Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to bring you guys another match day vlog. Today, the Western Sydney Wanderers are versing Adelaide United and I'm really hoping that we can carry on our seven game undefeated streak. And before we actually head into the match day vlog, I'm actually going to be doing a Bankwest Stadium tour so you guys can see the behind the scenes of what's going on. I'm also very excited to see the King come back, Mitchell Duke, and I'm also looking forward to see my cutie Costa. So yeah, I'll see you guys there. After Culture Kings, I made my way down to Bankwest Stadium towards Gate F, which the tour was being held. And when we got there, the guy who gave me the wristband wore the exact same outfit that I would wear if I was recording a Snack Pack Specialist episode, which I thought was pretty jokes. His name was Danny and he was a really nice guy. He gave us lots of facts as we were walking around the stadium. The thing he showed us at the stadium tour was the different hospitality boxes that you can rent out if you're going in a group. What's pretty mad about that was actually the view itself. It was exactly like what you guys see on TV when you watch games at Bankwest. see where the commentators sit. And what's funny was that before the game we actually saw the two hosts who took during the match days prepare hours before so they were just practicing getting their lines ready for the cameras and stuff. And who knows, maybe you guys will see me there one day during half time. My favourite part of the tour would have to be actually walking out onto the field itself because I never thought I would have the opportunity to do that. Purchase your tracks today. And of course, since I was right by the pitch, I just had to touch the grass with consent, obviously. And after we finished our one lap of the field, we went into the press conference room in which all the players and coaches do their interviews after the game. Overall, the stadium tour was really fun. I enjoyed myself getting to see the behind the scenes of what happens during a Wanderers match day. And I was really happy to bring you guys along with me. 
the tour ended around 2.30 and kickoff was at 5.05 So I walked back to the Westfields to meet up with my family and have a little bit of food before we went to the game So we head to the game a little bit earlier today so I can give you guys my first ever food review in which I went to Hoops Coffee House which recently opened not that long ago right outside of Bankwest Stadium I ordered a rookie burger which consisted of a 100% Angus beef patty, nice melted cheese, caramelized onions, pickles and some burger sauce, as well as a cookies and cream milkshake. As soon as I opened the burger straight away I could tell it was going to be really good. The bun itself was a nice toasted brioche bun and you could tell the patty came straight fresh off the grill. Overall, I'm going to give the Rookie Burger a 4.8 out of 5. On the other hand, the cookies and cream milkshake was decent. It was a nice consistency and it wasn't too sweet. So I'm going to have to give it a 4.2 out of 5. If I'm being honest, I think the burgers are actually a lot better there than in the actual stadium. So you guys should give it a go.
So the game ends 3-2 and what do you do when your team loses? You eat your heart out. So after the game, I had dinner with my family, turned my frown upside down and ended a really fun night for me. The only thing that was on fire wasn't the wondrous performance, but my freaking tibialis interior. I'm telling you guys, the amount of walking I did that day. <laughs> so that's gonna be the end of today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please feel free to give me any feedback down in the comments. And don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video.